าถาสีพึ่งจันสอนจัน incantation for a twin set of สีพึ่ง uh, lip gloss or uh, meta balm uh, such a sticky substance p r i o r substance which was blessed during uh, lunar uh, auspicious lunar uh, astrological alignments And is a double set of potions made with different ingredients, and uh, should be used uh, in combo, uh, or can be used individually, or stay all night. Uh, when you make magic, actually, you can, apart from following the rules, you can also develop what makes sense to you or what inspires you. Yeah. So in this case. Or if you're advanced and you understand as well, so in this case for me, I could use it um, day and night. Use one for the day, one for the night, or just one for specific purposes and the other for other purposes, or in combination. But this explanation is uh, for use in combination, so it would be to use uh, one kind uh, to go clockwise when uh, usually you smear it. Around the lips, not on your lips. Around, uh, don't put it on your lips. Put it around, so on your skin. Around, just a little bit. You don't need much. So a little uh, lid can last a long time. So uh, I'll give the kata first, and then explain a little bit about the si p e n g itself. Uh, <clears throat> there's a short kata, which is what you can use repeatedly. To uh, smear when you are smearing, or you can also uh, chant it silently in your heart when you're trying to call somebody to you. This is a mahasane, can be good for business or attraction. Yeah, enchantment, right? So and other things for well, mercy charm and stuff. So it depends how you use it, actually. So the short version is. นาสังสิโมปัสสุอุชาบอมอทายนาสังสิโมปัสสุอุชา and you should chant that ten times นาสังสิโม is also you might notice in the ตาวเรียนเทอร์เทิลมันทรานาสังสิโมปัสสุอุชา They're actually syllables from uh, Buddhist sutras, which represent uh, very sacred Buddhist sutras. And you should chant that ten times. So na sang si mo ba su ucha 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 na sang si mo ba su ucha. Yeah, and uh, you can say that when you're smearing. Doesn't matter if it's. Uh, Slow. Na sang si mo ba su u cha. Yeah, and when you know it by memory, you can get faster. There's no need to go fast. It's just go at your natural rate. So when you go fast, some people try to um, think that that's <laughs> important or something. It's not. It's not. It's just um, I actually happen to have ADHD, so um, I read fast, I speak fast, and so I'm going to teach myself to slow down speaking. If not, people can't follow me. So there's a long version to this kata. Oh, and before, just to confuse you, if you like to get confused, and some people do, uh, the short kata na sang si mo ba su u cha. If you really want to complicate it, or you think. This empowers your magic more. If you're an accomplished magician or experienced in practicing this kind of stuff, um, with the si peng that you go clockwise with, you could say na sang si mo ba su ucha, and the si peng that you smear anti-clockwise around your lips, so around on your 
uh, above your lip and below your lip, so around your mouth, yeah, not on your lips. You could say it backwards, yeah, but then you can decide because uh, there's two ways to say things backwards for me. You could say cha u su pa mo si sang na, cha u su pa mo si sang na. So you could start with the first portion saying na sang si mo ba su u cha. And then go anti-clockwise with the second portion and say cha usu <coughs> sorry cha usu pa mo si sang na yeah if you want to and if you want to just chant it to empower and blow on it and to blow on it when people blow on amulets you have to actually be able to raise prana or chi uh, air energy or if you can raise fire energy depends I use air energy mostly because that's more or less the only element I have any uh, conscious uh, mental control over to a certain degree not very much but a little bit so the long version of this kata the first kata you can do it just forwards for both or forwards for one and backwards for the other and this long and ten times chanted each and this long version so you do that when you're smearing it on yourself or others or uh, your wares what you wish to sell or you want to attract people or make your speech enchanting you smear it around your mouth or under your chin or on your eyebrows to attract people to like you and be attracted to you and so on so the long version of the kata for this uh, Double set of si pung, you know, chan son chan, which means uh, um, concentric. Uh, when the moon has concentric rings of light, they call it a concentric moon. Yeah, so chan son chan means concentric moon. So it's uh, an occasion when the moon has concentric rings around it, which is an astronomical and astrological phenomenon. Yeah, so it has astronomical and astrological meaning. Yeah, so the long version of the kata is Mutu jitang su wa mukang titsawa ni ma mang pi yang ma ma meta chu ha yamatu rang taka wa jang satang sutawa sap. Pe chana pahu chana iti chana samma nuna pramana nuna pasang santi iti iti piyang mama iti i name of the girl p or the boy piyang mama iti i name of the boy or girl Piyang mama na mo putaya na ma pata ja pakasa ma a o puto om sawa ha sawa ha piya mamang piyang mama. So I'll do it again and we're going to say um, <clears throat> the name of the lady and the name of the man. Lady first, name of the man. The lady's going to be called uh, Jennifer. Yeah, I'll say Jennifer, like Thai, we say. And the man will be called Alvin. So I'll say Alvin. Yeah, instead of uh, so I can say the kata completely for you. So it would be Mutu Jitang Suwa Mukang Titsawa. Nima mang bi yang ma ma me ta chiu ha yama tu rang taka wa chang sat tang sutta wa sape chana pa hu chana iti chana samma nuna pramana nuna pasang santi iti iti bi yang ma ma iti T E Jennifer Biang Mama E T I Alvin Biang Mama Natmo Puttaya Natma Pata Japakasa Ma U 
พุทธโธโอมสวาหะสวาหะปิยะมะมังปิยังมะมะ Yeah. So Jennifer and Alvin, and now perhaps one more time. m u t u j i t a n g s u a m u k a n g t i s w a n i m a m a n g b i y a n g m a m a m e t a c h i u h a y a m a t u r a n g t a g a w a j a n g s a t a n g s u t a w a s a p e c h a n a p a h u c h a n a i t i c h a n a s a m a n o n g p r a m a n a n a n g p a s a n g s a n t i i t i i t i b i y a n g m a m a i t i i j e n n i f e r b i y a n g m a m a i t i i a l v i n b i y a n g m a m a n a m o p u t a y a n a m a p a t a j a p a k a s a m a a u p u t o o m s w a h a s w a h a b i y a m a m a n g b i y a n g m a m a a n d u h t h a t i s u h f o r t h e u m สีพึ่งฮานุมานเกี่ยวนางเดือนแผ่นจันสอนจันสสคตาจันสอนจันสัสวสีพึ่งสีพึ่งฮานุมานเกี่ยวนางเกี่ยวนาง means actually to uh, lady wind around a lady but actually this can be used for men with men ladies with ladies men with ladies ladies with men yeah so uh, it doesn't matter what gender you are Because gender isn't actually just your physical gender, as we know, because people have different different preferences to do with your hormones, and uh, there's four ways of doing things, not two or one. So there's four ways of like four kind of attraction. Yeah, men to men, men to women, yeah, women to women, and women to men. So. Uh, This double set uh, of potions uh, was from Lung Po Pao or Wat Dao Ruang, and uh, the the Si Peng Hanuman k i o Nang Jan Pen, which means Hanuman, um, what would you say, uh, uh, embracing a maiden. Embracing a beautiful maiden in the light of the full moon, so it was made un- under the light of the full moon with concentric rings, with the double circle of light, with the penumbra. It's called the penumbra, and a lot of incantations were made. There's also some plat uh, plat tapien for luck and wealth attraction within. And because they're gold and silver for for wealth attraction, but also for love. Because you can see they face to each other. In the Si Pung, there are two little fish, barbfish, a silver and gold barbfish, yeah, and made from pure wild forest bees wax mixed with a hundred and eight Mahasane herbs, loads of sacred woods and pollens, which I won't list, and uh, the the actual Si Pung container. Usually has a hand inscribed sacred n a t spell inscribed on it. Uh, also blessed in Putapi s e g at Wat Dao Ruang, uh, with an additional ceremony called the Piti s e r b t a t Prawet Bangrajan, which is a very powerful and ancient <laughs> Ayutthaya uh, era occult, which uh, through the lineage transmission of the Ancient sorcerers of Bangrajan, and uh, the other one is the Si Peng Mahasane d u n d a Pet g l a p Jan Pen, which is the darker version, and that reverses negative karmic aspects. Which sometimes, if you use the single amulet, uh, and the odds are tuned in favor of some factors of your life, then it might leave holes in other factors of life, which could then. Get worse as the other ones get better, to equalize your karma. So the secondary potion turns the wheel of karma in both directions, allegedly, uh, being opposite in its magical spiral, i n the emanation of its uh, spiral light. Do you remember the moon with two penumbras? Yeah, uh, because the first ceremony was in the penumbra of a full moon, and the second ceremony was under the dark eclipse of a moon, chanting backwards. Yeah. Like I said, to reverse the darkness and the negative fortune. So I would especially say, if you want to do backwards chanting, you could do this uh, during eclipses, yeah, 
solar eclipses or lunar eclipses, yeah? Uh, and that particular portion is actually more difficult, just as is chanting backwards. And uh, then a third empowerment was given after each individual uh, portion was made on different astrological occasions, of course, because different empowerment needed different astrological occasions. <laughs> So uh, it's a bit like yin yang as well, yeah. Yeah, and they perpetuate each other. They 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 complement each other, just as the light fills the darkness, and the darkness is dispelled by the light. And the uh, light dwells within darkness, and the uh, darkness uh, is also permeated by light, as you can see by the white dot in the black part of a yin yang, and the black dot in the white part of the yin yang. Yeah, and so uh, that's about it, and except to say that uh, both the kata and the use of the sipung is uh, intended to bring great metamahaniyam, mercy charm, to the spell within the potion. So you can chant to empower, you can uh, chant to pray, usually it's chant to empower and uh, then smear it and use the short kata for when you're smearing it use the long kata for empowerment so you could do that in ritual at home for the long kata yeah and uh, have seductive speech and uh, preferential treatment um, and so on and uh, because it has platapian inside the two lucky barbfish, I would also say that uh, people who like to get extremely detailed with their ritual practice, you could uh, check out for information on the kata for platapian. Cool. Uh, I know I've definitely written up the platapian. And in my Buddha magic e scenes, there's the Yan Platapian, and I have Kata Platapian on ancientamulet.com. I know I have some items which are Platapian, Platapian, and they have very long write ups which have um, Kata and other information about Platapian. So anybody interested can look there and see if they can find it. So that's it, the, the Kata and information for Si Peng Hanuman Kyonang Dun Pen. Um, double the uh, potion for attraction, business, enchantment, mercy charm. Yeah, uh, very interesting set made with two very amazing and very complex rituals, and also created using very rare uh, ingredients in a very complex formula. So I think for the modern era, uh, not many of them were made, but I think for the modern era, this is actually very, very uh, diligently made um, set of potions. Two potions shows the diligence to make it a complete witcha. And so personally, I, I think this potion is very good because this tries to cover every angle for Mahasane and Mita without any karmic return and there you go so you can also use Kata Hanuman and Kata Platapian to increment because uh, you can use Kata Hanuman with the white one and Kata Platapian with the white one with the darker one don't need to. If you pray to them, make ritual over both of them, then you can add those kata. But in principle, all you really need is the kata, uh, which I just gave, the two short and long kata, which I just gave. Unless you want to complicate the matter, in which case you look for kata hanuman and kata platapian and add those as well. You don't need to, but if you want, you can. So, Ajahn Spencer for thailandamulet.net, ancientamulet.com, buddhamagic.net, and all of my other projects signing off.